keep your word. Always keep your word, man. Your word is everything. And everything you said you do, you did it. Couldn't talk about it if you didn't live it. Shout out to Jay-Z. Um, your word is your bond. Your word is all you have. If you all you don't have nothing else, you have your word. Always keep your word, right? And that's not just with men, that's with everybody, right? Let's let's let me give you an example. Or let me paint this in a relationship context, right? And when I say keep your word, I don't just mean like if you tell somebody you're going to, or if you promise somebody you're going to take them to the, you know, give them some money, you know, then you got to give them some money. I mean, like, even like if you threaten somebody, even if you, you, you know what I'm saying? You threaten somebody or you give somebody an ultimatum and shit, like you have to uphold that. You have to keep your word. That's a part of keeping your word. When we hear keep your word, we tend to think, oh, well, you told some, you promised somebody good, something good and you didn't deliver. And then that makes you look like a clown. That's not the only thing that makes you look like a clown. If you tell a man, I'm going to slap you if you call me a bitch again, and he call you a bitch and you don't slap him, that makes you look like a clown. So keep your word. Watch what come out of your mouth. If you promise somebody something, you better over-deliver. If you promise somebody, negative or positive, positive or negative, if you promise somebody something, over-deliver. But back to what I was saying in the context of a relationship, um, if you gonna, if you tell your woman, hey, if you disrespect me again, I'm walking away. If she disrespects you again and you don't walk away, she's going to look at you like a clown. And the disrespect is going to get worse and worse and worse and worse and worse. You have to keep your word if you want to be respect, respected. And this is one that I've always struggled with with women, right? Because I typically, I don't, I don't, I don't hold grudges. Right, I typically don't hold grudges. Like once I get it out of my system, I'm cool again. So it may be a situation to where we get into it, and you know, a, a chick may. Have, I mean, not nowadays. I'm not, you know, I'm firm on it now. But I'm saying back in the days, I, I struggle with that. Like we may get into a situation, and I may feel violated or disrespected. And it's like, oh, you, you you try me like that. I'm telling you, I'm getting up out of here. Right. And so once you calm down, it's just like, oh, okay, whatever, you let it go. But what happens is you that woman saw that you didn't keep your word. And it's just going to just, whatever you didn't like, they're just going to keep doing it. There's no incentive to, there's no incentive to, to not express themselves or not do what they did. Because all you're going to do is yell at them and threaten them and shit. So when you promise somebody something, when you promise your girl, if you do that again, your ass is going on the bench. You do that again, we're going to have to take a break. You do that again, you have to go home. When you promise her that, you have to deliver. Or you're going to like a clown and a man who don't keep his word. When you promise your girl something good, you have to deliver. When you promise your boss something, you got to deliver. When you promise your homie something, you have to deliver. You always want to make sure... I always want to make sure that you always, always keeping your word. Over prompt, what they say, under promise and over deliver. And be careful, guys, when you're dealing with men. A lot of you guys, I see a lot of you guys making threats to people. I see it in the comments. I see it on videos back and forth. Be careful, man. Be careful. There's some people, when you tell them that you're going to do something to them, you're going to have to do it to them when they see you. You understand? I come from that world like where, where you, you don't, you're going to do something to somebody, you better just do it. Because if you tell them, I right, be here when I get back, or I'm going to catch you when I catch you, and all that threatening people shit, what's going to happen when they see you and you got your motherfucking kid with you and you slipping or when you with your mama? What if they really on that? Or what if they really fear for their life? Your ass out of there and you don't even see it coming. You see what I'm saying? Or what happened when you see them and they confront you and you don't do nothing about it because you're scared. You was just wolfing. Now you're going to look like a clown and a buster to everybody. So to be mindful when you get upset and all this shit and you're making promises to do, oh, I'm going to catch you when I see you, when I see you. And then when y'all see each other, y'all chop it up and it ain't that. And it's, oh, well, we decided to be cool and we just going to, nah, bro. You know? 
Oh well I didn't mean it like that I was mad and upset Nah I don't hear that shit now You know you're gonna run into people Who don't wanna hear none of that peace And you know if Some people Some men that you're gonna run across man, and, and you have conflicts with When it's up it's stuck I know y'all know what that means When it's up When that shit go up it's stuck Meaning It's only one way to settle this <laughs> You know what I'm saying? So just be mindful, man. If you're not, you know, if you if 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 you're not sure that you can deliver on your promises, just don't make them negative or positive. Whether you're threatening somebody's life, whether you're threatening somebody with physical violence, or you're promising somebody some money, or promising them an opportunity, or promising them you're gonna call them, or promising them you're gonna get on a podcast or whatever, just be mindful. Of that you want to make sure you're always keeping your word Because that's all you have at the end of the day You can take everything else from you You got your word You got what come out of your mouth And that's bond 